Iowa, Penn State. You know what? I like Iowa's defense. I think Iowa's defense is going to shut down Trace McSorley in that running game. So I got Iowa winning a dog fight against Penn State. I'm going to go with Penn State. Really? Oh, oh, well, OK, yeah. champ. Right. Not so fast, champ. Not so fast. <laughs> Iowa, upset. You're going Iowa. <laughs> All right, just keep this thing on the tracks here. Two I'm going to go. Ahead. Yeah, I think so, yeah. I'm going to go Penn State because they're playing at home, right. and I think because of Trace McSorley. I, I love uh, You like Trace, Trace McSorley. McSorley. I sure do. So yeah. fast. I don't have play calling, man. All right, Texas Tech and Iowa State, both teams have a mathematical shot finishing the top two, getting the Big 12 championship game. They say the Red Raiders are playing better on defense right now. I like Brock Purdy. I like the Cyclones in a close one. Iowa State. Yeah, like Iowa State, too. Yeah. Home. It'd be that's good. A, that's a great pick, uh, champ. Way to go, Iowa <laughs> State. It's homecoming for them. <laughs> Iowa State. I'm great going, pick, I'm champ. going Iowa State at home. Give me Texas Tech. Really? Oh, no. Wow. Wow. Red Raiders, huh? No. You know, hey, they not let a... you down the last time you picked <laughs> yeah, them. Yeah. yeah. All right. Yeah. Herbie, Herbie's not picking this when Texas, Oklahoma State, because yep. he's calling the I'm game. So we'll go ahead and tell who's going to win, Longhorns on the road tonight or the Pokes? Oh, that's a tough one. I think, uh, I think I'm going Longhorns, you know. I think I'm going Longhorns. I think Shane Bichelle's going to come in and play well for him. I'll take Texas. Right, Texas. Hey, nice pick. Texas. 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 Champ says Texas. I'm saying Texas. All right. <laughs> I'm heading over there right after. Oh, that's right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, 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 yeah. I, I know. I know. He didn't have to pick. Yeah. Yeah. I, I, stole, right. I stole all of Herbie's information earlier on the SC Arizona State game. Just to remind you, no JT Daniels, the quarterback, who wins it? Um, <laughs> this is, uh, I don't know Arizona State. I think what well, USC started the third string quarterback. They've really been struggling offensively. I'm going with uh, Arizona State in a very close matchup, though. USC. USC. Oh, you're going to Trojan. Yeah. Okay. Let's give them a not so fast, my friend. Not so fast <laughs> with the champ and I. Southern <laughs> California. I'm with USC, too. Yeah? I, you know, I, wow. I, I, they're not having a great year. They're down to their third quarterback. But. Arizona State's not doing a whole lot right now no, either not. offensively. No. So You're I'll right. go. I'll go with it. If SC wins this game, yeah. real strong chance of being eight and three when they play Notre Dame at the end of the year. That'd be great. Can Washington State follow up and beat Stanford on the road? Yeah, I do. I think they will. I think just the, their passing game is so prolific that they're going to score a lot of points against Stanford. Then they're going to have a gimpy running game, uh, Stanford. So I like Washington State big over Stanford. I like watching Stace well. Yeah. And let me tell you, whoever gave you the information is giving you right information. Well, yeah, he's right. going to be the top of Washington State, State an upset. <laughs> yeah, it's an upset. It's it's an upset. upset. You had all those numbers, how impressive an Washington upset. State has been, upset. and yet they, after a big win last week against Oregon, they're an underdog. Yes, yeah, sure. uh, On the road against Stanford. I'm with you guys. I think Washington State quarterback play will be the difference, and Stanford struggling to run the ball and, and play well against the pass. So I think the Cougs get it done. All right, Texas A&M's on the road to Mississippi State. is going to play both quarterbacks, Fitzgerald and Keaton Thompson. Who wins it? Yeah, they have to because without that, they're one dimensional with Nick Fitzgerald as the quarterback. But I like uh, I like the Aggies. I like Texas A&M. I like Kelly Mond, Trevion Williams. They have a big game, so I'm going with the Aggies. I'm going with Texas. Texas A&M. Texas A&M. 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 The guy knows what he's talking about. I'm telling you. Texas A&M in an upset again. I'm going to I'm say A&M not only wins today, but they're not going to lose another Ooh. game the rest of the year. Right? I think A&M with, with Jimbo Fisher, Kellen Mond, defense. I, I, I'm shocked a and an underdog. Under, under. Those guys know what they're talking about. Yeah, I'm going you know, A&M. Yeah, LSU, yeah. so he just called the LSU win, too. Yeah. What about Kentucky and Missouri? You know what? I like this Kentucky ball club, but Drew Locke is an NFL quarterback. I think that they're going to win. It's going to be a, closer, a close game, but I like Missouri at home. I like Missouri as well. And Missouri. Upset. Gave the dogs a little trouble, didn't they? Not a while. so fast, my friend. Not so fast. Missouri. Because they're at home. That's you, it. You're going with Missouri? I'm yes, gonna sir. Go, I'm going to go with Kentucky. Ah, you know, I, I, I'm good. I, I, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's one of those things down yeah, at the yeah, bottom, I feel, huh? Yeah. I feel good about that three. Yeah. The, <laughs> the, the Look at that. Yeah, I'm Perfect. going with Kentucky to get it done. Oh, Bear talked about it, though. All I know. those trends going with number 12 going on the road and still being that underdog of the game yeah. everyone's waiting for here in Jacksonville. Georgia and Florida. They call it a party, but Isaac Nauter from the dog said it best. They don't like us, and we don't like them. That's what you want. A little hate, a lot of disdain, and huge stakes for both teams.
Florida Georgia is always such a big game. You're talking about adjoining states, so much history in the game. Ultimately, it's a chance to get bragging rights over a team that we have to play and recruit against. Both teams want to win, you know, so it gets a little bit chippy. The stadium is awesome to see. It's kind of split down the middle, red and blue. And it's always between two really good football teams, so it'll be a dogfight, but our team's excited for that. Usually the team that wins this rivalry wins the SEC East. Keep playoff hopes alive and SEC championships hopes alive. It's what you dream of as a little kid, so just to be able to play in it's surreal and really exciting. All right, you're feeling the Gators. It's <laughs> time to let the big dog eat, Desmond. RD, I tell you what, Georgia went down to Baton Rouge. They got their bus kicked, but they had a week to try to fix their issues. They know where their weaknesses are. I think Justin Fields is going to play some today. I think they're going to fix their weaknesses. Close game, I got the Georgia Bulldogs over the Florida Gators. He's got Georgia. Kirk, who do you have? I think a lot of people are down on Georgia because of what happened in Death Valley with the way their offense played. It reminds me a lot of last year when Georgia struggled at Jordan-Hare, bounced back two weeks later and looked like a different team. I think it's Jake Fromm is the story today. I think they get aggressive offensively, make plays against that great Gator defense. Georgia knocks off the Florida oh, Gators. Man. Two Georgias and champ with your son being the leading rusher. You don't dare go against the dogs, do you? Well, no, it's Georgia. The Georgia's a real deal. Yeah. Georgia's a real deal. <laughs> Great pick, champ. Great pick. Gentlemen, I have a problem today. Uh-oh. I'm 0-5 anytime I put <laughs> the bulldog head on. <laughs> That's Sweetheart. Uh-oh. You know how hard it is for me put a gator head on it. Okay? Oh, do I? You've done it, though, over the yes. years. I live in Orlando, Florida. Yeah, that's true. Not Orlando, Georgia. <laughs> Give me that gator head. <laughs> oh, oh. oh, wow. Oh, haven't seen wow. this in a while. Wow. <laughs> I haven't seen All this right. thing. I'm so glad it's still there. Yeah. <laughs> that, hasn't come, that hasn't come out since the Tebow era. Yeah, wow. the dust wow. 